Today we're going to be exploring the underground remains of a coastal gun battery that was constructed in the Second World War to defend Dover Harbour from enemy shipping. It was named South Fulham Battery. Construction began in 1941 and it was completed in early 1942. It had four 9.2 inch guns installed and these had a range of just over 17 miles. They were manned by the 540 Coastal Regiment of the Royal Artillery. South Fallen was the largest coastal battery that was built by the Royal Engineers for the Dover area. We have created a series of videos that will take you on a journey into the forgotten underground remains of South Fallen Battery. Let's go folks and see what we can find. Folks, right, so the next day, a bit of Dover exploring. We're going to meet uh, Andy, ALW research team, at the uh, Premier Inn, I think it is. So, we'll have a breakfast, a big breakfast, and then we're going to get out and do some exploring at the uh, east of Dover. So, uh, yeah, let's keep going. What'd you say, Chris? Yep. Right then folks, so we had a massive, massive breakfast in the, uh, what's it called? Table Table. Table Table yeah. Pub and Restaurant. Well, to be honest, it's quite a <clears throat> posh place. Help yourself, eggs, bacon and all that jazz. Uh, it so was, Andy's just... Uh, it wasn't bad, was it? Uh, yeah, Andy's just gone up to the uh, room, sort himself out and he'll be down in a minute. We're all in this van, I believe. So yeah, it's gonna be good. Right here yeah, then folks, so we're in the van. Good um, morning. It's Andy. Hello. And it's day two, so uh, up to uh, Gun Battery, east of Dover, South Foreland, I believe it's called. I think there was a 9.2 inch, four 9.2 inch guns there. So they're quite big guns, actually, yeah. to be honest. Uh, um, so yeah, let's go. We've got to get the key first. To visit this site, you have to have permission to get this key, and then you can go into all the tunnels. All the tunnels are locked with padlock, because they locked them like, for preservation. And, they didn't want to seal them up totally. They wanted people to look at these things, so they um, basically locked them in and then gave you access to a key. So uh, yeah, I think Facebook, um, you can get hold of someone on Facebook. Who has a key? Did it, Chris? Yep. I don't know about naming names, what do you reckon? Probably not, but if you ch check out some yeah. of the, uh, most of the, he's on most exploring groups. Yeah. And if not, it does say on the front of the shelter, yeah. please call, blah, blah. There's been a lot of breaking, sadly, so yeah. it's just, it's not, you don't it's need to. Keep, if it keeps happening... Oh. Jesus, well, it's it's a bit hot for all that chest, isn't it? If it keeps getting broken into, they will see. It's 25 degrees and he's got a blanket on, isn't it? Is that Jesus? Not even though, it could be Jesus. Looks like it. And trousers. <laughs> One of the hottest days of the year, folks. Got a, homeless is a very sad thing if he's a homeless. It is, yeah, um, and it's a very real thing. So yeah, let's keep going, folks, to the battery, South Portland. Oh, it's not fun now. <laughs> right, yeah, then, folks, so yes, we're at South Portland Battery. Uh, 9.2 inch guns, I believe these ones were, four of these guns. <laughs> That's a big gun battery, this one. Um, but it's yeah, it's a bit off-roading. It? It's got, it covers quite a large area yeah, as well. Yeah, it's a massive area. A lot of stuff was pulled down probably in the 60s. The cookhouse still remains, which the old uh, the yobbos have sort of made into a playhouse and burnt it out and all that stuff. Oh, sorry, that's it. It's a bit, it's a bit bouncy. And, um, yeah. We're heading to South London Lighthouse area because uh, that's where our journey's going to start. There is a um, one deep shelter, one plotting room in that area. Then we make our way back to this end where we are just driving now. Uh, another deep shelter. Another plotter room, and there's four magazines and all that jazz. So it's a big old site, Andy. Nice one. Looking forward to it. Yeah, it's going to be mental. Yeah. So, let's go. Big hole. Cattle group. Wow. Come on, man. Right then, folks. We're at the van, South Fallen Battery. Done in here. Yeah. ALW research team folks. Hello there. 
and uh, yeah, we're showing them around. I've filmed this over decades, basically. Um, but yeah, on various cameras over the yeah. years. How many different cameras? Uh, over 10, I think, probably. Yeah. So I had the Sony, Panasonic, mini DV ones, you know, and all that jazz. Yeah, so just to clarify, you were, you were filming for YouTube before SD cards existed? Pretty much, yeah. The military probably had them. I was going to yeah. say, because you, yeah, you used to record on cassette tape. Yeah. Yeah. Back in them days, mate. Do you know which is which? What's that? They've got different names, haven't they? This is Deep Shelter 2. Yeah. Oh wow. So originally that was in a blockhouse with a fan and heater room on it. And um, that was bulldozed and then filled in. Bashed into this. These are the bricks that it would have been these would have been part of the blockhouse. Yeah. And you can see part of the wall here. Oh yeah. Look at that. So this is deep shelter number two. Number two. South fall and battery. Yeah. And That's this is personnel well. shelter. So shelter. it's you know we're 60 feet underground. Yeah. Must be around that. And yeah. um, 125 steps down. Who's got the information here? Right. So Chris is the key holder, or key holder is Chris. There's more bits to block out there. Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, why keep it when you can smash it to bits and just leave it in a pile? Yeah. Because was the. I would actually think it would look neater with the blockhouse still there. Yeah. Than smash it, bury it, but still have lumps of concrete sticking on the ground. They should have took tin out to bury it better, if, if I was doing that. No, if I was doing that. But this was called Operation Eyesore, to remove the eyesore. Right. But I think they created an eyesore yeah. by smashing its bits. An Operation Eyesore was a Dover District Council operation in the 1970s to tidy up Dover. Right. And I think they made it worse. They did. You know, that's just a mess. The Dover Corporation wanted to fill in the uh, the moats, the Western Heights, with uh, landfill. Yeah, yeah, they destroyed Archcliff Gate. Ooh. Yeah, and they filled in the Western Outworks, Defence Caponier, and all that. They wanted to do that with the whole heights, but luckily they never got to it. So good, crazy. Mad, right, good. back to World War Two, folks. <laughs> right, Chris has opened this, folks. So yeah, for the key holder, you have to contact for the key. Don't break in. No, we've got the key look. That is the key. That looks quite steep. It is quite. If anybody is down this way, I suppose, and does have a problem, if they message one of us on the page, yeah. one of the admins, I'm sure someone can point them in the right direction. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's that way. I think it's a backpack off. Oh. We've got to lock this while we're inside, haven't we? Yeah. To stop people coming in, just in case. And then it's we funny lock when you come out, though. Because people are like, how do you do that? Yeah, good morning. <laughs> oh, wow. That looks quite compact. You found some graffiti. Well, here is the plaque that says who to contact. Oh, is it? Oh, that's yeah. all. Oh, right. So we can film that then? It does say you can contact National Trust. Yeah. yeah. Right, we're getting there. We'll film that then, folks. Oh, yeah. Could I pass you this? You can. Please, please. So Are you right just going to leave right those there? there. Right. I'll film you going in. It's probably on the front. If you get, I was going to say, if you get your foot, you can use that bar. Oh, yeah. You'll probably be right because you're taller. Yeah. Just put your foot on the, the ring. The, uh... Oh, need knee pads for this, viewers. If you yeah, come here, knee pads. Shorts ain't the way to go. Nah. Sadly. <laughs> Unfortunately not. But, you know, it's a good experience. <laughs> yeah, what, the nope. pain? Yeah. Yeah, because if you slip now, you snap some ribs. Oh, turn your torch on. You've got a bit more down. There you go. That's the side bit. The steps are slightly lower. Okie dokie. Oh, yeah, there we are. Oh, it's not so bad, actually. Just pull my bag in. Here, all the egg sacs are there, look. Is that exposing? The leg sacs. Let's go down here. Two many stairs within the tunnel. How many meters down did you say this went, Chris? Uh, was it 75 feet? 75 feet. I actually thought it'd be more. I thought they're all around 60, near enough. 
I would have said. I think it depends where you're measuring from, though, aren't you, as well? Is that, you know, is that the top of the uh, block house? Yeah. Oh, right, yeah. I would have gone from ground level yeah, down. Yeah, so I mean, it depends, I suppose, how they've measured it. I, I don't yeah. know. Watch out for them loose bricks there. Yeah, this is not. This is actually clearer than it used to be. Yeah. 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 We can see the other side. They cleared this side and put all the rubbish that side. Yeah. Which is a bit better, I guess. Oh, the ventilation ducts in there. That's what that is, viewers. So they used to have forced ventilation down here. I think this one was burnt out. What was it? Yeah. I don't know if it was mattresses or car seats, tyres, but it's proper, proper um, blackened stuff down here. It's not a clean one at all. Was that idiots doing that? I reckon so, yeah. Yeah. I did find a 303 bullet down here though, live. Did you? Yeah. Nice. We'll see, hopefully we'll find some casings actually. Yep, yeah. little slip there. Watch the hopefully I'm near the well, bottom. I the steps are clean to a certain point and then it's like, no, I got ball. Yeah, and it's just, uh, just chalk. There's a detachable ring pull type beverage can there. Oh, that's an oldie. Yeah, that is old. Colder, I think that is. Whoa, gimbal. Watch your head, I've got to say that. Yeah, what is that? That is Crush. Crush Orange. Can you remember that, viewers? And it's in a steel can. So that is really old. Crush can. Yeah. What's your Chris? Whoops. Here oh. we are. So this reminds me a little of... Uh, I don't want to say, oh, lid and, not lid and spout, the other one that you took me down. What was that one? Is it rocket? Is yeah, it's a rocket, yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. Similar design. Have a look round here, you might be able to find some bullets. Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll do it after. We'll have a look round yeah. the shelf and come back. Come back. Then. All the electrics have been pulled down. Yeah. So that's people. Have a little shine yeah, down there with that torch, Chris, full beam. That's how you do full beam double Yeah. That yeah. is bright, that torch. That is really, really good. That's one of my favourite torches, that one. Yeah. Better What's than that another light? Listen. Did you hear that? Hmm. It's like a rumbling. Yeah. Before, this you, before you said listen, the minute you said listen, it stopped. Yeah. There do is you know... a noise from down there. Yeah. Wolfie. There's something down there. Wolfie, um, who, you know, he's a patron and... Wolfie and his son, yeah. a patron, and he's an explorer as well. I used to work with him. He had an experience down there, saw a mist or something like that. So this might be a haunted tunnel, I don't know. I'm just going to put it out there. The top of that thing where that vent is, it's been dug out, I would say, by rabbits. Right. So there is a slim chance that there's a rabbit running around. Yeah, there's something down here. I could hear it moving. I'm not saying it's a ghost or a poltergeist, but there's something down there. So this was a deep shelter for the gun battery personnel. Yeah. So they, apparently they didn't use it. The civilians were allowed to use it, but the um, the military didn't actually use it. Is that according to that plan? Right. Oh, they right. didn't. They didn't want the. Um, that little bottle up there. They didn't want the military running down here every time bombs started dropping. They wanted them up there, obviously Working. fighting back. Yeah. But I suppose it may have been used when you know if it got really bad. Shine talks down. Yeah. Listen. Interesting setup. Is that supposed to be like an army person? <laughs> it looks like a person. Oh no, that says exit. Yeah. Do you want to keep it there? Uncle? Yeah, can you? Yeah, yeah, actually, it'll drop the, drop the ISO. Little tin man. Someone's gone to a lot of effort. They've even put a smiley face. And the eyes are like the War Ministry arrow. Yeah, they are, aren't they? Yeah. What an interesting. What an interesting person has made that. A little bit like a Minecraft person. Yeah, Steve. Very interesting. You never know, that fridge has been down there. Every time we come down, it's, it's always moved. Has it? Yeah. That thing there. So yeah, it would have been bunk beds and stuff down there, I reckon. Yeah, probably. Did you just hear that? I heard something, yeah. I just, I just heard something. What did you hear? That. Let's have a look, folks. Yeah, there's something down here. That's a load of. Is that wire wool? That's um, wire mesh. Wire mesh, the chicken there. Chicken wire. That was originally the fence going upstairs. 
has the insulation wrapped around oh, it, and yeah. then that wrapped oh, around yeah. it to hold the insulation on the yeah. um, air intake. That's the one Look, there's something missing there. Beam. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's a bit cross beam, isn't it? It's taken out. Yeah, I haven't noticed that before. That's quite strange. Was that the top to. I reckon that's been taken out recently because you can still see the rust marks where it was. Yeah. 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 Someone's taken a piece out. Why would you do that? Hmm. Strange. So that's been purposely built. Is that for a stove? I'm not sure. It may butt the sink. It's too low. Mm. These, you know, both the shelters out here have that thing. Mm. I just don't know what they are. Well, if you know viewers, leave a comment. The other one's got the fair free bullets around it, so we're, we're having a good look, folks. It's in every uh, both entrances. Two entrances entrances to the shelter. It's quite a small shelter compared to the other one that has three uh, entrances. Mm -hmm. Again, on the floor here is probably the insulation from the uh, ventilation. Yeah. Or wood. It looks like a lot of the wood that they used to wood and paneling used to put on the sides to like lag it. Yeah. It's quite damp down here, look, viewers. It's been swept in it into this corner. Yes. But that was dusty. And that's a really old can of paint. Now, is that the, the paint that they used to, you know, the whitewash paint? Is that what that is? I was, reading, I was reading up on uh, Colin's website, Subterrain Exploration. Yep. Um, and he says, well, no, he didn't say, but comments about this battery, people saying that before they demolished all the buildings and stuff like that, there was still all the equipment left down in the shelters, and a lot of it was taken out, taken to museums. All right. right. Um, which I thought was quite interesting. Yeah, it? that's very interesting, because they'll be intact still, so that's a good thing. Yeah. Interesting to track down where they went, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah that's it what I thought. It'd be, it'd be nice to sort of go and see, mm. go and see the what things that used to be down here, yeah. It's probably one of them cases where it's just been taken to a museum and it's not, it's totally, you know, forgotten where it come from. Yeah, or it's in storage in the back. Yeah. So a piece of tin there that's probably taken out the top, maybe. Yeah, that's come down. And is this another piece of the X blockhouse? Oh yeah. And another kind of paint there. I think that is the whitewash stuff. That could be from a long, long time ago. Right, staircase up. Is that key behind me, Chris? That's, yeah. uh, yes. That's all right. It's just knocking against the camera. Uh, right. Listen. I heard something then. It sounded like a pigeon or something. Like, There's something down here, yeah. I heard something. So, right here. That was weird. Yeah, there's something down here. We think it's a rabbit, viewers. Could be anything, couldn't it? Well, a saint might be up there, so let's go and check it out, please. Yeah. What do you do if you want a rabbit? Do we have to like, take it out? It ain't going to enjoy itself down here, I would have thought. Because it's probably lost. So, uh, the thing I worry about is that we're bloody locked in, folks. Yeah, we are locked in, yeah. We're locked in and there's something down here. Because these steps are with us. The steps are what, sorry, Chris? Quite steep. Yeah, they are, Nothing here. No. Yes. Mm. Okay. Can you show any torch up there, please? Yes, I can. Wow. That's proper backfield, isn't it? Yeah. Do we know where that came out? No clue. It must be near that house somewhere, surely. Towards. Yeah. Okay. You reckon in front of the entrance then? a lot of rubble. That's yeah, this weird looking, this is uh, over towards the lighthouse end. Right. Near that private building, okay. house, Yeah. I'd say. Right. Mad folks, isn't it? Yeah, that's crazy. But we haven't found the source of that sound. <laughs> no. That's strange. 
There's a wooden baton in there. It's nice that. That's done. It's survived well, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there's a bit of mould on it there. There's some good penicillin in that. Whoa! Yeah, the air smells really clean. Yeah, so all the electrics have fallen down by the looks. And there's some cabling. Oh, yeah. Some of the existing electrics. That's the sort cable. of cabling I was expecting to find my house when we pull the floorboards up. Yeah. yeah. 1940s. I did actually, we did find some that looked a bit like that that was not in use anymore, which no. was good. Yeah. yeah. So it looks so it's had a rewire. Yeah. And then they just left the old stuff in. Yeah, it makes things a bit cheaper. Yeah. So back down the stairs we go, viewers. As we continue the explore of number two deep shelter at South Pole and Battery. Move the rocks up the middle of the stairs. That might be a good idea. it was when you'd say if you were down here when they were demolishing the guardhouse the above. Well wow. imagine yeah. being down here and hearing the guns boom. Oh yeah. Yeah like, there were nine point two inch guns so they're quite a it's quite a um, oh, yeah. quite a punch. Yeah the four and a half inch guns we call it a Mark 8 gun on type 42 destroyers when I was on those when they fired that gun, you could hear it through the full ship. Wow. And it was loud. Yeah. You know, even say if you was, the gun was at the front near the bow, and I was down the tiller flat ones, which is where the rudders are controlled from. Right. Uh, and you could hear it down there. And that, that is actually underwater, that bit. Wow. If you know the outside's underwater, you're below the water line, and you could hear it, it's like boom, and it shook the full ship. Wow. So, 9.2 inch guns, and there was four of them. Definitely hear that down here. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely. Hey, it's not that, is it? It's like, also when this gets shelled, you're down here with the shelling going on above. Yeah. Are you going to, you know, you're going to get chalk probably falling out gaps, aren't you? Like, oh. Even more so now, because just above Ian, there's another cross beam being removed. So oh. <coughs> Why would you we do We would that? have noticed that. Yeah, I mean, that looks relatively new to me. Yeah, they've been taken down. Wonder. But at least it's locked, so this isn't getting proper trash by the idiots. It'd be interesting though to go back in the footage and have a look. Yeah. I found the pigeons you mentioned in Z Rocket. Oh when yeah. You went down there. Yeah, yeah, the, yeah. I watched one of your real old videos and there was pigeons down there. Yeah. Crazy. <laughs> even older ones, probably from 2004, you could see them even better because when you walk in, they'd be like being pushed deeper into the tunnel. Because they obviously fly away from you, so you'll be walking in and they're flying into it more, you know. So, yeah, South uh, Z Rocket Shelter. Loads of pigeons like when we first got in there. Indeed. What's the matter, Chris? Nothing. I thought I heard something. Yeah. I was standing there and I heard like. God, I can't. The dirt. I can't see anything. Go in there, mate. Oh, is it up there? You can see. I mean, it could be something silly as mice running around. It yeah. be enough to... Something small in all this wood. I can't sense anything. No, no I can't. No. I'm just... That, I've just that, got a feeling there is something down here. That, that beam... It's, it's nice. Oh, no, yeah, that's creepy, that. Those um, air blocks on the top, one of them nearly fell on me once. Oh. In deep shot of one, the wood was broken. Like, and walked under it and all of a sudden it collapsed. Yeah, because this is, this is a wooden uh, door casing and it's just got the air bricks sat above it. Because again, they've, you can actually see, we were talking about this yesterday, these shelters were built in such a speed that they put the door cases in and simply bricked around them so the mortar was wet and it actually bonded into the brick. There is a lintel, slightly wider, but it's also wood. If you look at the top of the door frame finishes there, You've got a lintel added in. Goes a little bit further than the door frame. But it's oh, still yeah. only wood. There's no, yeah, well, there's there's no structure, is there? What was this bit for, Ian? I'm not sure. Storage or, <clears throat> or important person office, maybe? I don't know. It's um, yeah, segregated. Like all bunk beds out in the main tunnels. But this one might have been sergeant, maybe, or officer. Bed in here. 
Yeah. Maybe. Ah, uh-huh, so this wasn't toilets like I'm thinking it was. This could have been like a mess deck. It might have been, yeah. So the other mess ones deck. have toilets sort of at the bottom of the stairs, don't they, as you come in? Yeah. Yes. I think this is too big for toilets. It is, yeah, unless they... Officer's mess, maybe. Unless they had the, the uh, chemical buckets along the sides there. They used to have first aid points, didn't they? Mm. But this was like a sick bay. Right, yeah, yeah, it might have been, yeah. It's weird because the plans don't really tell you. No. no it's, uh, who knows, viewers? Leave a comment if you've got an idea of what this room would have been. Not this room. Try and touch down there a minute, Chris. That room. Yeah. That looks really nice. It's because it's so black in here, it soaks the light up. Mm. Yes. Yeah, there's the remains of the wooden sheeting that used to come up the walls to insulate it. Yeah, it's quite some, look, there is some there. Uh, what's that? I think that's what this end. Off. That looks like something like the uh, end of uh, some sort of rocket or something. What do you reckon? End of a rocket? Yeah, it looks like a cap. Like out of, a, out, out of like um, an ammo crate. What do you reckon, Andy? Uh, I'm not quite sure when, like, foam or polystyrene really came into. If I'm honest, that looks like armor flex, and that is what you'd put on, like, um, you'd put that on the liquid receiver on a fridge pack. Right. Yeah, because that looks like polystyrene foam. So maybe something to do with the fridge that's over there. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. It could be, yeah. Yeah, that's off. Uh, you'd put that on a liquid receiver on a fridge. To keep the to keep the heat energy out. Yeah, so that's not World War Two. That's very modern. That. Yeah. Got to check it out there, folks. Haven't we? Yeah. It's interesting that it's down here, though. Yeah. It's interesting. Well, there's a fridge down here. How the hell? Yeah. You see the soot. It's obviously come down before it's been sealed up. So what's, what's this thing? Next to the bin. Look at that. Oh wow! I know what that is. Vent. That's the vent off the top. Yeah. Only made its way down here. Look at that. Oh wow. It's like the ones, the ones just, they remade. They've just remade them for one stone. One stone battery, yeah. Oh yes. That National Trust Band was telling us about yeah. them, wasn't it? Do you know what? I'd never seen that down here. Uh, that's a bit of history though. Where has that come from? Like if that'd been laying down here for years and years and years, I'm surprised it's still here. Yeah. They're not even walked on. Because no. I think they used to make those out of like zinc or something like that and it's right. quite soft metal. So if it was stood on it, it'd just squash it. Yeah, it's so like, like someone tossed it in. It's like mm. took it off and just threw it down there. Yeah, just made its way to there. It's nice, isn't it? Bit of history there, folks. Yeah, really nice. Well, that's all what happened with Townsend, wasn't it? It was used just as a rubbish dump. All the rubbish was just chucked down there before yeah. it was backfilled. Yeah, it's crazy to think that. That's supposed to be the same with this. Fridge has probably been down here since like the 60s. Yeah. It's very yeah. bright looking that way with two. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why are you squinting, Chris? Yeah, yeah, open them eyes up, lad. You need the sunglasses. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> Another fridge. What's that? as a cooker. It's a creeder. You reckon you, you get that one going? I was just going to say that. <laughs> I, think part, I think parts might be a problem. Yeah, it's one for Chris to repair. Any parts you could take off that? I think it's had it, to be honest. What the fan? I'm not going to start moving it around, but don't forget we have found these before with War Department logos on. Oh, yeah. You move it over, see if it's on the back. There isn't a the back. Oh. Yeah, the back's missing. Yeah, Creeder. Are they quite an old brand? Do they still exist? Um, it's Hot Point. Ah, uh, okay. What's that there? Is I that don't, yeah. A can of grease or something? We've seen them in like later, like 1960s kitchens at places, and they've got the water pot with on the back. Wow. <laughs> yeah, as if, um, if they used to sell to a pot, they used to have. Yeah. Up in Ross Safe Naval Base, there used to be a shop and they used to sell like MOD things in there. Right. And there was cookers, there was all sorts. Yeah. You could get full kitchens that they'd taken out of married quarters. Yeah. That is quite an interesting bucket, that, because that's yeah. got the stenciling on. Yeah. 
And that could even be, uh, so it's 25 slash LT, so 25 litres of B R U G F. I can't really work it out. Can't work out. Is that like a black paint? I was wondering, it's not like a bitumen type thing, is it? Just mm. look at the black on it. Yeah, B I T U. Could be bitumen. 25 litres of bitumen, yeah, this stuff. You used mm. waterproof, wouldn't it? Yeah, they used to put it on the uh, HQ bunker. I reckon that could be original. That yeah. could very well be original. That's from like build. I don't know if we're actually looking at stuff more this time, because we're finding a lot more stuff. Mm. Seen yeah, like the bin over there. Yeah, the rotten Next bin. The... We've got a couple of middle bits still, too, haven't we? Oh. Yeah. So I wonder if at some point it has been partially stripped because you could take those out for scrap yeah. without the place falling down. But then saying that, why wouldn't you take the little stuff? Yeah, like a zinc. If you scrap, then you'd take that. Unless yeah. they didn't realise it was zinc. They thought it was just gal. But I don't think they made much stuff out of gal back then. Yeah, so this is one of the cross passages. And they used to use these as mess decks. And again, there's there's always a wheel. Yeah. Everywhere we go, there's a wheel. There's a few that, wheels in here. That looks old, doesn't it? I still don't get it though. You think, oh well, I'll, I don't need that wheel anymore on my car, so I'll take it off and I'll throw it down the shelf. Same, like same as shoes, isn't it? You know, I, don't, I only need one shoe. Yes. That's an yeah. Avon radial. Well, there's still some decent tread on that. Thirteen inch. I'm gonna fit the van. No. It's pre-dates. I don't know when they start putting dates on stuff. But wow, look at that. I wonder if Eddie Wood knows what what maps off. So he's quite good at identifying wheels. So what do you reckon, Eddie? Well Avon's a good tire brand, isn't it, Chris? I think so. eBay jobby? You reckon someone buy it? <laughs> no idea. Probably cost Probably go for thousands, imagine that. Wow. Yeah, like obviously, it would go to the National Trust folks, donations. Oh, yes, absolutely. Yeah, so, put the debris down here. Loads of wood in there, burnt. And... Makes yeah. you wonder what it would look like before the fire. Oh, Chris, there's, there's a piece of the crossover. Oh, yeah. It's just. They're, the, they're them. That's one of them. That holds two bits together. Yeah, so, so one, one of those is missing. So, that's probably. It's either a spare yeah. one. Or one from where they've removed it. Underneath, this is there. Oh no. You see all the ventilation's gone. Yeah, it's all been pulled out, hasn't it? I wonder if that was gold. Yeah. You get it's strange though, because I mean the ventilation down the stairs got left. Yeah. And if you were stripping yeah. it, you'd take you just could take what was on the staircase. Just because yeah, it's, it's easy to get out. It's weird, isn't yeah. it? Wait a minute, did we miss we didn't miss a cross section. Well, no we did, because we came in that way. Yeah, we've not been through this one. Right, just the one. So I've been through two. the first one, the last one, and then we'll come through the middle one. So it should be the wrong side of the army. Yes. There he is. Minecraft person. That lid is for that bin round there. That's got green paint on it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, well. See, that kind of goes to show how much spare time people have on their hands because they painted the bin green. Yeah. That's the military for you. Piece of uh, history that people probably don't realise. Yeah. It. Wife in the military. Someone needs to come down here with a Henry though. Yeah, blind. Imagine yeah. how many bags you'd use up. Yeah. Some uh, what's it? Shake them back. Yeah. <laughs> I'd love to paint this up. It, it, it's a doer up here. This is a proper man cave. Yeah. So if, you know, if this was done up to a good standard, you could sell this for a lot of money. National Trust, if you're listening. It's an easier one to open up as well, really. It's, it's pretty much open. Yes. Isn't it really? One Just of the times you come down, there is one actually open that's in quite good nick. Yeah. It, it's, a, it's a National Trust tour. Oh, it's what, Fan Bay? Yeah, but it is mm. nice. Yeah, it's a, yeah, it's a very good one, that. Though. Yeah. They've done a good job on that. But I went down there when it was a hole in the ground. Wow. <laughs> and they've dug a whole lot out and they've done a lot of work. 
check it out folks uh, fan bay the deep shelter tours um it's definitely worth the look have you got a classic video for that probably yeah i think it might be on that production one ikes productions it might be uh, yeah. i'm not sure right we're going to stop here we're going to look for a bullet folks i swear there's going to be probably a blank uh, a bullet that's gone off with the fire because i found a live one but let's have a little look yeah Yeah. On the head to buy the merch because at the moment no one can buy the merch. Uh -huh. So this is all the blockhouse uh, rubble, half of it. The vent that goes up. Look how high that is. That's mad. It is nuts. I mean, it's bad enough for the camera in a backpack. Can you imagine like bringing materials up? I'm assuming that was, if it, whatever was stripped out was stripped out before the blockhouse went. Ah, uh, right, yeah. Work out on the legs, isn't it? It is, yeah. Stairmaster challenge. At least the air's clean. You feel it getting cleaner? Yes. Feel it getting hotter. Yeah. Wow. Wow. used to go to the ventilation plant room which was out here next to the blockhouse that's also been demolished is that right yeah, yeah. all that's demolished it was connected to the main entrance basically wow. it was just another room off yeah, the main so door a big, big fan in there um, to supply fresh air down into the into the deep shelter below right down there how mad yeah so Ian's got the key because oh, we are actually course. locked in yes Right, so uh, got the key, folks. Hopefully, it works. Doesn't snap off. It looks a bit um, battered, actually. <sighs> we watch when you swing that round because that's I never would have be in the face. Yeah, that yeah. would have been unpleasant. Right. Oh, do you want to quickly film that, Chris, while we're here? Uh, about that. Yeah, that's it. Oh, yeah. Just so we can freeze frame that then. Yeah. So yeah. check them out, folks. And then that's it, right? I oh, know I've already filmed that. I remember that. Yeah, I thought you did. Yeah, I forgot. Yeah. You made that look easy. So that's an inverted IKS. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be in bed for back pain now. <laughs> Can you see straight up your shorts? Oh, uh, yeah, I'll blow that out. Right, let's go, folks. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. Well, right, yeah. Awesome, you might as well take that to the next one. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. There we are. Andy's bag. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Shall I go next as I'm standing here? You want to go last? Yeah, you don't want to last, yeah. I know some people are anti coming out last, aren't they? After hearing them weird noises in there? Yeah, there was some weird noises. Oh, I think it was that cattle grip. Yeah, it could be. It could well have been. We didn't find anything, did we? It'd be interesting to see a car goes past when we're out here. Yeah. I think it's easy to get out and get in. Ah, I'm pleased you said that. Ooh. There he comes, folks. Don't mind being filmed, do you? No, no, no. Some people don't like being uh, filmed struggling, do they? Like, number one fan. <coughs> he loves it. <laughs> Look at that, it's easy. Oh, wow. That was a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. Oh, so stand on the key, the phone, and the torch. Right, so we can lock this back up and. You right doing it? Yeah, I think so. Just don't drop the key in. Yeah. Or the lock. Oh, locking it back up. 
So as the plaque said, you can get the key by contacting. There's a lot of places, National Trust. Yeah. Or you, or you can go down the route we do. Yeah, so there's no need to break in, folks. No one's going to have no a go at your class. And there it is, folks. Let's go.